श्री कृष्णा श्री कृष्णा श्री कृष्णा श्री कृष्णा गुरुर्ब्रह्मा गुरुर्विष्णु गुरुर्देव महेश्वर गुरु साक्षात परम ब्रह्म तस्म श्री गुरव नम तस्म श्री गुरव नम इन द फर्स्ट वर्स श्लोका थर्ड वल्ली सेकंड चैप्टर कठोपनिषद वी आर टोल्ड दैट दिस होल वर्ल्ड इज सपोर्टेड बाय द रूट दैट इज अल्टीमेट ऊर्धमूलो वाक्शाक यशोस्वस्थ सनातन तस्मिन लोकाशिता सर्वे तदुनाते कशन Now, what is the purpose of telling this? That this is the truth. The purpose is indicated now in the second mantra, where it is said, "Yad vidyanat amruta bhavanti iti uchchate." Having known this reality as our essential nature, one attains immortality. <coughs> what does it mean? We don't die. No. whether you know or you do not know you cannot die marne bhi nahi denge yad vidyanat amrita bhavanti uchchate jagatah moolam tadeva nasti brahma asat evam etar nisrutam iti tatra therefore <coughs> it is said that if the world is not real does it mean the root of this world brahma is also not real therefore to tell that no the world is not real it is appearance but the substratum which is supporting the world is real meaning what ornaments are not real but the gold is real see so what is the meaning of this reality of this world and what does it do this is the second topic yadidam kincha jagat sarvam prane ejati nisrutam mahat bhayam vajra mudyatam ya etad vidhute amruta bhavanti yadidam kincha jagat sarvam the whole world now what is the whole world whole world is the three components in our experience no our known knowledge यदिदम किंच वॉट एवर इनसिग्निफिकंट इट मे बी हि यदिदम किंच जगत सर्व द कंप्लीट यूनिवर्स प्राणे ए जति निसृतम सी इट इज अपियरिंग इन द इन्फिनीट डांसिंग इन द इन्फिनीट एंड डाइंग बैक इन द इन्फिनीट सी देर आर सम पीपल हू हैव गॉट देअर चैनल ऑन यूट्यूब एंड दे आर प्रेजेंटिंग again and again how many great mahatmas are hogs they are useless they are making some jadoo trick like that pc sarkar used to do they also do like that and they become mahatma this is only because they have not known the truth see friends <coughs> our yoga shastra tells that when a person goes through a proper discipline of controlling the mind and stage by stage when one goes beyond a particular limit he gets the knowledge how to create things by mixing the five elements 
See, <coughs> because everything in this world is made out of five elements. <coughs> Now these great Mahatmas, who are not defending, who are not shouting, who are not trying to prove anything, they are silently living in this world. And those who are uh, fame-oriented people, putting all kinds of things. They say, "Oh, these people are only really doing the magic show, like a PC Sarkar and it's all rubbish." No. See, in our Dakshina Murti, Bhagwan Shankara Chary says, "Maya kalpita desha kala kalana vaichitra chitri krutam Maya viva vijrum bhayati maha yogi vayasvechaya Maya viva." When an ordinary magician can create all things. Will not these great masters who have the prakriti under their hundred percent control? They can, because we don't understand. We think it is rubbish. No, it is our inability. See, friends. Now, if you take the life of Bhagwan Sri Krishna, such people who say they accept Bhagwan Krishna Bhagwan, but if you take his life. Is it not full of magic and uh, all kinds of things? See, he told all the people in Dwarka that we will be shifted to, uh, no, not Dwarka in Mathura. We will be shifted to Dwarka. So, what you have to do, all of you, close your eyes and then open. And a whole lot was shifted to Dwarka. When he has done that, we accept him as God, whom we have not even seen. And these great masters who are able to help millions of people, see friends. Therefore, this whole world is under the uh, absolute control of this reality. And how it is under the control of reality, prane ejati nisrutam. So this whole world is appearing and dancing in this absolute truth. Why it is dancing? Because mahat bhayam vajra mudyatam. Now this is another important principle. Love, love, love. Don't get lost in that stupid word. Vishasmad vata pavate. It will be told. The world is perfectly running, not because of love. The world is perfectly running because of the fear of the truth. See, mahat bhayam vajra mudyatam. There is such a terrible fear that everything is behaving properly. Etar vidu te amruta bhavanti. Those who know this reality. They attain immortality means they are now free from all fear of life. We all suffer never because of the death, but because of the fear of death. See, in the sixteenth chapter, Bhagwan Sri Krishna begins the word first, abhayam sattva samshuddhi. The real spiritual life is begin from abhayam, fearlessness. Where there is a fear, there is a samsar. See, therefore, the fearlessness can appear or experience only if we are one with this fearless reality. Therefore, mahat bhayam vajra mudyatam ya etar vidhu te amrita bhavanti. Those who know this reality, they are not at all afraid of anything. In our Bhagavad Mahapurana, a story comes. Bhagwan has taken Narasimha Garu avatar, and in that avatar, when Hiranyakashipu was killed and all that, and then even uh, Lakshmi ji, Narayana's wife, she was frightened. Who is this terrible? I can't go near. Everybody was afraid, but not the uh, Pralad, see, because he has recognized the divinity. Therefore, friends, what we have to understand that real freedom from fear 
is only if we know our truth otherwise we are all the time i am afraid i will reach there or not i am afraid i will get a cup of tea or not i am afraid whether the bathroom will be open or not afraid 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 is that life therefore what is this paramatma doing bhayad asya agnistapati bhayat tapati surya भयाद इंद्रश्च वायुश्च मृत्युर्धावती पंचमी इन अदर उपनिषद इट कम्स भीषास्मादातपवते भीषो देती सूर्य भीषास्मादग्निश्च वायुश्च मृत्युर्धावती पंचम से भीयश इति भय भयात अस्य अस्य परमेश्वर से बिकॉज द फियर ऑफ दीज परमात्मा अग्निस्तपति the fire does not have an option it has to remain hot bhaya tapati surya the sun also is showing the heat and light only under the fearing rod of this parmatma bhaya indrasya vayushya all the faculties and uh, air etc they are functioning in the discipline of this reality and mrutyur dhavati panchamaiti and even the death is functioning under the fearing rod of this reality meaning what a person who is free from the fear of death a person who is free from all kinds of fears he has transcended the mind where is the fear fear is in our mind the mind goes to imagining if i go there and if i don't get food <coughs> what will happen see all the time living under fear therefore to go beyond all the fear about this world only way is abide in yourself and this is what is the real spiritual practice otherwise every moment we are leading our life under extreme fear <coughs> in uh, sanyas diksha there is one mantra given see let there be no fear from me to anybody in this world <coughs> one of the sankalpa that is taken see let there be no fear from me to anybody if we are following the path of renunciation and people are afraid are baap re baba ji aa raha paise mangega bhi ha kya dar no and therefore if this is <coughs> not recognized in this very life then what happens ih ched ashakad buddhum prak sharirasya visrata tatah sargeshu lokeshu sharirattvaya kalpate now here is another important principle as we think so we are you think you are body yes no problem then except you are born you are growing you will have health problem you will have disease one day you will die no i am body but i should not grow i should not become old i should not die if you don't want that don't claim that you are a body or now i am body i am soul is it not only in our mind see the silence is because of sleep <laughs> i can experience the sleep <laughs> samashti sleep <laughs> that's why i told you why you people are taking food this is not the last supper <laughs> actually this uh, lunch should not be given <laughs> then also there is a problem all the time thinking about food <laughs> so ih ched ih ched ashakat buddhum prak sharirasya misrata prak sharirasya sharirasya misrata means what before the body is dropped if we do not come to know our essential nature see so it is a threat 
<coughs> we have to know now and here. And how to know now and here? Be happy. You are making us miserable by telling be happy, be happy. <laughs> <laughs> See, friends, what is trouble with us? We know only becoming happy because of something or that. In being happy, there are no efforts. Wherever efforts are involved, we are miserable. See, <clears throat> till we are not sleeping, efforts are involved. Then we turn this way, we turn that way. All the time struggling, cover yourself, oh that is... <laughs> but once the sleep begins, see, then immediately, Om Purnamadha Purnamadha Therefore, Ihachet Ashakat Bodhum Prak Sharira Sevi Sarata we have to know the truth now and here. Be attentive. The knowledge takes place. The experience happens. <coughs> we live only now and here. We cannot live yesterday. We cannot live tomorrow. We cannot do anything yesterday. We cannot do anything tomorrow. We cannot be happy yesterday. We cannot be happy tomorrow. We have no choice but to remain in utter present. Uh. See, friends. How is he? <laughs> See, there is a mantra in Mundoko Upanishad. Uttishthata jagrata prapya varanya bodhata kshurasya dhara nishita durutteya durgam patastat kavayo vadanti. Normally, what should have been said in the mantra? Uttishthata jagrata means what? Get up and then wake up. How it is possible? We should wake up first and then get up, is it not? The mantra, scriptures know. See, waking up is not a problem. Getting up is a problem. <laughs> See. So, prak sharira semi Now and here. It is never then and there. And this can be achieved by our mantra. Wherever you are, whenever you are, whatever you are, be 100%. See. So, here we are, now we are, and sleeper we are. Over. You are realized. Therefore, Prag Sharira Sevisarata, Yachet Ashakat Buddhum. If you are not able to do this, then Tataha Sargeshu Lokeshu Shariratvaya Kalpate. Then you will be subjected to Punarapi Jananam, Punarapi Maranam, Punarapi Janani Jatare Shayanam. That will continue incessantly. Nobody can stop. See. <clears throat> when you go out of this hall, the last thought will decide what is your next destination. See? Now you may be thinking this, that, okay, but that last moment, that will decide what is your destination. Exactly the same way. At the time of death, meaning at the time the body drops, if that time there is any thought that thought is our blueprint for the next life. See? Prana prayana samaye kapavata pittav kantha virodhana smaranam kutaste at the time of the death, when the body is left behind, the prana go out, that time all our efforts become null and void. 
that time only that happens which is done effortlessly i'll tell you an example about this there is to be one lady a um, buddhist lady from gangtok gangtok ah uh, in sikkim so in the winter months november december january she used to come down to uh, mumbai and i was those days in kaivalya dham i had a beautiful big quarter so she used to come and stay with me and very sincere whole day she will be physically very busy do this do that and sleep night and all the time swami ji swami ji swami ji has to make fun of her see how dirty the house is so she will clean <laughs> keep busy and i was in us that time that time she died here and when i came back her son called me he said swami ji you know mom has passed away as yes i also heard he said we do not know what she wanted to talk but she was only saying swami ji swami ji and we tried to hear but we could not only she was saying swami ji swami ji swami ji swami ji anything which happens effortlessly that alone is with you where is my dog where is my dog what will happen to my dog after i have dog oh, oh, oh. <laughs> see on the contrary if you are constantly chanting the lord's name sri ram jay ram jay jay ram sri ram jay ram jay jay ram see and if you are able to keep your mind absolutely thought free then like the ice cube melts in the waters without making a noise na tasya prana utkramanti the prana doesn't leave the body atra brahma samashnute while he is very much in the body he has already merged with the parmatma this is the story of bhagavad mahapurana what happened by listening to the whole bhagavad to parikshit he came to know that he is not body and while he was in the body he has already dropped the body identification and therefore when the takshaka snake came and we have beaten him that time it was killing the dead body for him see friend vimuktasya vimuchyate therefore if this is not known by us right now and here tataha sargeshu lokeshu then again you are born every time you will die in the born and see ram 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 then shariratvaya kalpate and what kind of body you will get you will get that kind of body what you have given a blueprint see see friend we have to be distinctly clear about it there was one first sanskrit movie if you have seen about bhagwan shankara acharya and in that movie it was shown wherever bhagwan shankara is going to go there is to be two characters young boys they were also going along with him so one person who was sitting next to me it was the premier show we saw he asked so how many who are these two boys i have read the shankar vijay there is no mention about this thing these two boys i said these two boys are the, are the characters for us to understand one character was death and second character was wisdom bhagwan shankara acharya moved in this world with his two companions wisdom and death see then only we remain alert we do not know when the air has gone out and forgotten or i pull gaya khatam you cannot take a chance see friends and therefore 
what is to be done by only one simple thing be happy that's all when you are happy your mind is free from thoughts but when you are in sleep you may be thinking you are happy but you are not because thought is also the sleep is also a thought only happiness is not a thought <coughs> see patanjali maharshi says abhav pratyaya lambana vrittihi nidra nidra sleep sleep is that thought where the absence is the object of knowledge absence of waking absence of dream that experience is called as the sleep therefore <coughs> if somebody dies in sleep then i don't know what happens <laughs> why should i spoil my tongue therefore don't die in sleep tataha sargeshu lokeshu shariratvay kalpate now having said this thing <coughs> now this is another very different type of thought when i read this i was so thrilled यस्माद इह एव आत्मन दर्श आदर्श आदर्शस्थ इव सुख मुख से स्पष्ट उपपद्य से न लोकाशु ब्रह्मलोकाद्यत्र स दुष्प्राप कथम सी वेन वी कम टू रियलाइज अवर एसेंशियल नेचर वाइल वी आर इन द ह्यूमन फॉर्म देन ओनली द रियलाइजेशन इज मीनिंगफुल distinct clear no doubt in other places it is not distinct it is doubtful now what is the meaning of that it is said yatha adarshe tathatmani when you are awake as now probably if you are awake now and at this moment you are fully convinced and you have this experience that none other than you ever exist you are ekameva dvitiya although appearance may be many but you are one like there may be the son the husband and father but i am one in the same manner there may be appearance of multiplicity but the truth is one he who comes to know while we are awake that experience is distinct like we see ourselves in the mirror no doubt about it so when we look into the mirror do we ask somebody yaar ye kon hai kahi se kab se dekh raha hai mera dost no i have no doubt about it is it unless you are a child so yatha adarshe tatha atmani yatha sapne tatha pitru loke see there are many people who are very sincerely doing uh, this day they say there are some 15 days i don't know what is going on i have never understood all these things so in that they say you have to do the tarpanam is the pitrupaksha matrupaksha and bhatrupaksha padar and kya hota hai so when somebody comes to know uh, the truth after going to pitrulok you have done all the karma kanda giving the tarpanam this and all that then you have already booked your ticket to pitrulok go there and after you go there what will be your experience of the reality yatha sapne like in the dream sometime you are happy sometime you are miserable sometime you are miserable sometime you are more miserable so in dream so pitru loke yatha sapne then yatha apsu pari eva dadrushate tatha gandharva loke what is gandharva lok gandharva lok is classical music <laughs> or bharatanatyam i am really surprised and i have never been able to understand this what makes these girls do bharatanatyam and what is bharatanatyam kicking the floor floor tak tak <laughs> and simple things made complicated is bharatanatyam we do no scale no ste na na
and all this uh, adrangatram, what they do it. <laughs> you will see these people, they spend thirty, forty thousand dollars. See? And after the pictures are taken, and that also funny, they play that thing, what you call uh, Yeshoda Krishna or something, Devi, suddenly, <laughs> There is a Gandharva Lok. <coughs> See? So how it is that experience is like Yatha uh, Apsu Pari Eva. Like when there are waters and in that water you look and the water is disturbed, water is muddy. So how the reflection will be? Kabhi kabhi thik lagta hai. Whenever I am on the stage, I am happy. But if there is nobody calling me, I am waiting. See? Same thing happens with the poets. There was one person who came for studying. And <clears throat> he was, uh, after I was talking on Kathopanishad only. After one lecture is over, he will come back. Swamiji, yes. First time elderly person, so I entertained. Then he was entertaining me. <coughs> so he said, Swamiji, your today's lecture, I have put it like this. And he made some poem out of that. Oh, very good. It was my mistake. <laughs> Next lecture, another poem. <coughs> Third lecture, I should run away, don't come. <laughs> See, all the poets want a victim to listen. Similarly, the singers. Similarly, the dancers. See, these people, this Gandharva log, they are living only on the stage. You can see the life stories of many so-called big, big uh, cinema artists and drama and all that thing, you know. When they are off the stage, they are blank totally. See, that is, that experience is like the reflection in the waters. And chaya tapa yoho iva brahma loke. But if you are able to reach Brahma Loka, then it is distinct like the shadow and the light or the shade and the light. But problem comes. To go to Brahma Loka is not so easy. But you are already in the Manusha Loka. Already there. Why not utilize this time? Don't postpone. Unless we recognize the urgency of this, it will not happen. See? We should, be, we should have urgency, but not impatience. It has to be done recognizing the value thereof. In this manner, when we do not know the truth, we are born again and again from one life to another life and continue <coughs> suffering. And if we are able to recognize our essential nature, now and here, we have fulfilled our life. See? Just imagine, for the sake of imagination, you go and happen to talk to the mother of uh, Swami Vivekananda. What will you talk to her? Amma, your son is so great. Millions are inspired by him. What will be the experience of that mother? Fulfillment in life. Do we have that fulfillment in life? It can happen only. Iti guiyatamam shastram idamuktam mayanaka etat buddhva buddhiman syat Krutha Krutesha Bharata, Krutha Krutesha Bharata, life is fulfilled. How can it happen? Etan Buddha Buddhiman Syat. See, this is Guhya Tama Shastra, ultimate, nothing more beyond this. And therefore, the only purpose that is left in our life is spiritual evolution. Ahara Nidra Bhaya Maithunancha. Eating, sleeping, living in fear and procreation. If these are the only pursuits we are following, 
God will correct his mistake. He will say, Beta, I am so sorry. I made you human being. Go to pig. No. See, let us not uh, feel regretful. Why did I kill? <laughs> create this fellow? No. Now the question comes. If we are convinced of that in this life alone the truth is to be known. No postponement. Is it possible? And if it is, how? Now here the teacher says, Indriyanam prutak bhavam udayasta mayau chayat prutak utpadyamananam matva dhirona shochati Indriyanam prutak bhavam Indriyanam shrutra dinam there are five sense organs. And sva sva vishaya grahana prayojanena sva karane bhya akashini bhya prutak utpadyamananam iti atyamta vishuddhat kevala chinmatrat. Now, what is meant over here is. Now, one example I will give you only. Space, the tanmatra of the space is. The Shabda. So from the Shabda Tanmatra, the gross space is created. From the Sparsha Tanmatra, the air is created. Air, one of the five elements. Then from the Rupa Tanmatra, the Agni Tattva is created. From the uh, Rasa Tanmatra, the Jala Tattva is created. And from the Gandha Tanmatra, the Prithvi Tattva is created. Five of them. So, Indriyanam Shrotradhinam, these five sense organs, Sva Vishaya Grahana Prayojanena, what for they are created? See? Eyes are created to illuminate colors and forms. Ears are created for hearing the sounds. But what happens? We get lost in the specialities. Therefore, sva sva vishaya prayojanena sva karena bhya akashe divya prutak. And therefore, the vision is as if separated from the colors and forms. The hearing ability is as if separated from the sounds. They appear to be separated. Now see what is the experience. A simple example. Uh, sweet. Um, what do you call it? Rasagulla. And Rasagulla by itself doesn't suffer from diabetes. <laughs> see? Rasagulla is sweet. Rasagulla doesn't also know that it is sweet. Then we lift that pathetic object. I don't know how people like it. Like they squeeze it like a dead rat taking out and you know. <laughs> See? So we take that rasagulla and put it on the rasana tongue. See? Then what happens? Rasagulla is sat. Tongue is chit. When there is a difference, there is salivation. <laughs> when the difference ends, when Rasagulla lands on the tongue, then everything closes, eyes, mouth up. <laughs> this is Antarmukhitva. You have become introvert. And that ananda is when the division of the knower and the known disappears. See, this is what is mentioned here. All the sense objects and all the sense organs, both of them are created by the respective tanmatra. 
So the Tanmatras are responsible for creating the faculties and the Pancha Mahabhutas are responsible for creating the respective objects. This is what is mentioned here. The Prutak Utpadya Mananam Atyanta Vishuddhat. But when you are no more influenced by the presence or absence of any object, then you are back with yourself. Atyanta Vishuddhatvat. Kevala Chinmatrat Atma Sarupat. Then you are one with yourself. Meaning what? Presence or absence of anything in this world does not create any turmoil in us. What is the turmoil? Constant complaint, <coughs> argument, discussion, evaluation, suggestion, a turmoil. Therefore, Dekho, Suno, Matso. Dekho, Suno, Suna Mat. Huh? I can see many of them are having Shambhavi Mudra. <laughs> but you must appreciate my courage. <laughs> see? Our scriptures are doing the same thing. See? Anadi mayaya suptaha jiva yada prabuddhate. In Mandukya Upanishad Karika it comes. We are sleeping for millions of years. Yada prabuddhate. When he wakes up, there is tea after the lecture. Hey <laughs> 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 friends. There are Prutak Utpadyamananam Atyanta Vishuddhat. And then he comes to know all of them have the origin from the one which is undifferentiated, non specific truth. All this, if you want to practice, only one thing make absence of sound as the object of your awareness. Now, if you have misunderstood, you are struggling. If you are understood, the understanding will be no sound disturbs us. Deko Suno experiences of Nama and Rupa. Suno Nama, Deko Rupa. Nama Rupa is this world. Deko Suno, when you are functioning in this world, Mad Bolo, don't react. Now, whether you are sitting in the chair or in the coach, whether your eyes are open or close, whether you are standing or what, it makes no difference. This is what is mentioned here. Prasak Utpadyamananam Atyanta Vishuddhar Kevala Chinmatra Atma Sarupat Prasak Bhavan Sabhava Vilakshanam Atmatam Tatha Tesham eva indriyanam udaya vastam ayocho utpatti pradayo jagra sapna vastha apekshaya atmanaha na iti. See, so our faculties become functional when we are identified with the body. When identification with the body is dropped, eyes are open but seeing is not happening. Ears are open, but hearing is not happening. See? So, where they have gone? When the mirror is taken away, 
where the reflection has gone. See, the more we become subtly aware of this, that like the bubble gum from this absolute pure consciousness, the first life, then mind, then asmita, then tanmatras, then panchamahabhutas, then the five objects, and then the whole world. Again, it goes back in the reverse order. So, where from it begins and where does it end? If we remain aware of this constant phenomenon, we are able to jnatva, iti jnatva matva vivekataha dhiraha dhi matra na shochati, then he will never, never be miserable. See, friends. Things come and go. How many times waking experiences have come and gone? It made no difference to us. How many times dreams have come and gone? It's okay. No problem. Anything which has come and gone is bluff. See, that which has never come and never go, this is the truth. In this way, manner, Atmanaha Nitya Ekasvavasya Abhivyakti Chara Shoka Karanam Anutpatte. Therefore, this self is never Vyavichari, ever the same. Like the clouds with thunder and rains come and go, nothing happens to the space. Like the clouds only with the thunder, no rains come and go. Nothing happens to the space. Let there be darkness, night, <coughs> nothing happens to the space. Let there be cloud-free space. The space doesn't become pure. Exactly the same way. Waking is like the raining clouds. Dream is like the thundering clouds. Deep sleep is like the darkness of night. And the Cloud-free blue sky is like Samadhi. All the four conditions do not touch us. Hold on to that. And to hold on to that, only thing is stop reacting in life. And how to stop reacting like? Dukkheshu Anudvigamanaha. We go through the miseries, but don't have to become miserable. It is not that great Mahatma did not have problems. They had problems. They had miseries. But they did not become miserable. That is all. Bano mat kush. In this manner, Dhira na shochati atmanaha nitya eka sabhavasya abhivyakta chara shoka karanam karanatvam anuvapatte he. Because the self has never changed ever the same. So many things have come and gone. Nothing happens. Therefore, don't struggle. Now, on this, questions come. Swamiji, if we don't struggle in the office, then they throw you out. What should we do? Don't come to satsang. Go anywhere. <laughs> we have to know how to apply this knowledge. See, a small child is crying and all that. And therefore, should we start telling, Beta, Brahma Satyam Jagan Mithya Jeeva <laughs> You talk to the child in the language that he understands. See? In the same manner, when you are in your office and all that, if you have to prove, prove, yes, I am better than him. See, I can't cheat more than him. Do it. But there you don't become, you go to the office and meditation. No. There are many people, they do like this. In Calcutta, this happened. 
देर वॉज वन पर्सन हु केम फॉर माई टॉक ही सेड स्वामी जी यू आर ए सत्संगी एस एस बट यू आर कॉन्स्टेंटली बिजी डूइंग यूर जॉब सो वेल देर इज वन पर्सन हु कम्स इन आवर ऑफिस ही हैज गॉट इन दैट टिपिकल बेंगोली ड्रेस पैजामा एंड कुर्ता एंड शबनम बैग He comes in the office with all the dot com and lines and everything and all kinds of mala vajanti wala and everything. He will come there and he will not work. And he start telling everybody, "Gita padho, joda joda, hi dharmas ya glani bhavat ya." What can you do? It's a manufacturer defect. I am very happy. Bhagwan Krishna was not Bengali. See, the whole Bhagavad Gita would have been different. Sankaro naraka yeva kulak dhanam kulas secha. In the first chapter, Arjuna has words. Sankaro naraka yeva. Sankar is the cross breeding. Naraka yeva. We lead one to narak. बेंगाली भी सिर्फ शंकरो नरका ही शंकर जी को भेज देंगे मैं नहीं जाऊंगा सो ही वॉज टेलिंग देन ही कम्स विद ऑल एर स्पिरिचुअलिटी बट डजेंट वर्क एट ऑल इन द ऑफिस एंड एनी बडी कैन स्टार्ट गिविंग लेक्चर सो नो बडी गोस्ट टू हिम सी फ्रेंड दैट इज नॉट द रियल वे Very well, you are. Whatever is your job, do it beautifully, perfectly. But don't get entangled in that. <coughs> in this manner, tarati <coughs> shokam atmavit. The one who is <coughs> abiding in the truth, tarati <coughs> shokam. He will have miseries, but he will never become miserable. This is one of the simplest thing I told you number of times. <clears throat> we do meditation, and we become meditator, and then the comments. Comments are what. कल का मेडिटेशन जमा था आज जमा नहीं इज इन आइसक्रीम और वॉट कभी जम के कभी नहीं जमा वेन एवर यू स्पेल एनी एक्सपीरियंस एन एक्सपीरियंसर इज बॉर्न इन मेनी प्लेसेस पर्टिकुलर नॉर्थ इंडिया यू गो वेन महात्मा आर टॉकिंग समथिंग सटल पॉइंट दे टॉक Immediately audition down. Are you are satsang? You are giving clapping to the. It is not a performance. See, similarly when they sing the bhajans, when the bhajan is over, they clap. In one place, I say, hey, don't do that. In the temple, when somebody is singing bhajan, Bhagwan before Bhagwan, you should not clap. Because it is not a performance. If you want to clap, go to Jaluta. <laughs> मेरी चुनरी री 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 फाइनली द ऑडियंस बिकम टायर्ड हाँ पहली बजाते तो क्यों बट दिस बिकम्स अवर सेकंड नेचर वी हैव टू कॉमन रिस्पॉन्ड ऑन एवरीथिंग रिमेन कू रिमेन कू then our mind remains at peace with ourselves <coughs> now this method how we come back to ourselves is told this was already told in the earlier chapter indriye bhya param manaha manasaha sattvam uttamam sattva dadi mahan atma mahataha avyaktam uttamam avyaktatu param purushaha vyapako alinga evacha यम ज्ञावा मुच्यते जंतु अमृतत्व च गति दिस टू मंत्रास दे गिव अस दि जी पी एस नियर अराउंड अबाउट टेक टेक द थर्ड एक्जिस्ट 
सेकंड सेकंड एग्जिट लाइक दैट इंद्रिय भ्या परम मन बी अटेंटिव तन इन अर्लियर प्लेस द मंत्र इज इंद्रिय भ्या परा हर्था अर्थेभ्य परम मन मनसस्तु परा बुद्धि बुद्धेरात्मा महान परा महता परम व्यक्त अव्यक्ता पुरुष परा पुरुषान्न परम किंचित सा काष्टा सा परागति ही आर द सेम थॉट वर्ड्स आर डिफरेंट सो ही आर डिसेड इंद्रिय भ्या परम मन पर सी हाउ मेनी टाइम दिस वर्ड हेज कम इंद्रिय भ्या परम मन मनस सत्वुत्तम सो दिस पर मीन्स थ्री वर्ड्स थ्री मीनिंग पर मीन्स कॉज पर मीन्स सटल एंड पर मीन्स प्रत्यक नियरर दैन द नियरेस्ट कीप दिस थ्री मीनिंग्स इन अवर माइंड सो इंद्रिय भ्या परम मन mind is subtler than the sense organs mind is the cause of the sense organs mind is nearer to us as compared to the sense organs indriya bhya param manah then manasah sattvam uttamam nearer than the mind is the eye the vidnyanamaya kosha nearer than the mind or subtler than the mind is the eye and the cause of this mind is this i so manasa sattva muttamam so we give up the sense organs come to the mind we give up the mind come to the i after that sattva dadi mahan atma be attentive from the individual with reference to individual i the total i mahat tattva is subtler because individual i is the effect and mahat tattva is the cause now see the to understand it in a simple language <coughs> our individuality is definitely influenced by the totality where we live see you must have seen those who are <coughs> from india not born here when they talk english it has got a different <coughs> accent when your children or grandchildren they talk also the english but you don't understand what they are talking it is the same english because the impact of the totality is distinctly seen in the individual see if you go to up in up before every s they have to add e everybody is start is my ah aspashta अस्पष्ट बोलो देवी नॉट से स्पष्ट बोलो अस्पष्ट बोलो अस्पष्ट दैट इज द वे सिमिलरली इफ यू गो टू बेंगाल वॉट एवर एजुकेटेड दे मे बी दे विल हैव टू ब्रिंग दे आर फॉर वन गुड थिंग इन बेंगाल नो बडी इज वरीड ऑल आर बरीड डोंट बी बरीड बी वरीड so the individuality is always governed controlled influenced by the totality in the same manner uh, manasah sattva muttamam so sattva is the individuality sattva dadi mahan atma see friends what is our understanding about life what is the understanding of life according to other religions totally different See, for them, killing others is religion. See, therefore, this sattva dhabi mahan atma and mahataha avyaktam uttamam. And in comparison to the totality, the unmanifest, the unmanifest cause is subtler. So, unmanifest cause, then <coughs> manifest at the total level, karan atma. then manifested at the individual level i then manifested at the mind level then manifested at the sense organs level then manifested at the individual object level see the journey indriya bhya para manaha manasaha sattvam uttamam sattvad adhi mahan atma then mahataha avyaktam uttamam अव्यक्त इज द शक्ति 
ది మాయా దెన్ అవ్యక్తాత్తు పరపురుష సి మాయా హూజ్ మాయా ఫైర్ అండ్ బర్నింగ్ పవర్ దాహికా శక్తి సో ది దాహికా శక్తి క్యాన్ బర్న్ ఎవ్రీథింగ్ ఎక్సెప్ట్ ద ఫైర్ దేర్ ఫోర్ సట్లర్ దెన్ దిస్ అవ్యక్త అవ్యక్త నామ్ని పరమేష శక్తి సో సట్లర్ దెన్ దాట్ ఈజ్ అవ్యక్తాత్తు పరపురుష ఈ ద పురుష తత్వం ద అల్టిమేట్ ట్రూత్ వాట్ ఈస్ పురుష ఇట్ ఈస్ డిసిఫర్డ్ ఇన్ టూ వేస్ పురిషయనాత్ పురుష ద వన్ హూ ఈస్ ఎక్స్ప్రెసింగ్ త్రూ ద బాడీ యాజ్ ఈజ్ కొల్డ్ ద పురుష దేర్ ఫోర్ జీవ అండ్ పూర్ణత్వాత్ పురుష బికాస్ హీ ఈస్ ఇన్ఫినిట్ హీ క్యాన్ ఫంక్షన్ త్రూ ఆల్ ద ఫైనైట్ అండ్ ఎట్ ద ఇన్ఫినిట్ స్టేటస్ ఈజ్ నాట్ లాస్ట్ దిస్ ఈస్ ద మీనింగ్ ఆఫ్ ద పురుష సో యం జ్ఞాత్వ అవ్యక్తాత్ పర పురుష వ్యాపక అలింగ ఏవచ వ్యాపక దేర్ ఫోర్ పర్మియేటింగ్ ఇన్ అండ్ థ్రూ ద టోటల్ మ్యానిఫెస్ట్ అండ్ అన్మ్యానిఫెస్ట్ అండ్ ఎట్ అలింగ ఏవచ కెనాట్ బి ఇండికేటెడ్ లైక్ దిస్ ఆర్ లైక్ దాట్ సి లింగ ఈజ్ వాట్ లైక్ ట్రై కలర్ ఈజ్ the linga of india so when you look at the tricolor you are reminded of india see in this manner alinga there is no linga because it is nirgun nirakar without form without attributes alinga evacha yam jnatva muchate jantu now <coughs> this has to be known yam jnatva how to know this knowing can be only by being don't try to see god has come god has gone sit for meditation light has come but afterwards never the light came last time i heard nice flute this time pata nahi piano is <laughs> these are all the tricks of the mind see friends otherwise you will get lost in that we have come across so many of them you may be knowing also there is one group they teach what they call leaping like a frog and they tell some kriya various kind of kriya and by that kriya they get a jerk in their muladhar chakra and then they take a leap like a frog so after the students practice it for few months or six months or whatever then there is examination taken by a bigger frog <laughs> what can you call them guru frog ka guru frog hi hoga <coughs> so they are sitting and then he gives the signal 1 2 3 and they jump all of them then when they fall there immediately a mark is made <laughs> six inches two inches no movement <laughs> see friends these are all the vikrutis it has nothing to do with spiritual life see friends therefore yam jnatva muchate jantu yam jnatva etad buddha buddhiman sat say same words we only have to correct our understanding about ourselves see this example also i have given earlier it comes from panchadashi one person was told by other one that your son met with a terrible accident in america he started getting miserable then his wife told call and find out so he called and here day in india and there is night so the son got the phone and scolded dad how many times i told you stop this nonsense then the father is happy <laughs> see this is the story now tell me who was miserable father was miserable so whenever you are disturbed no you have become somebody 
all the spiritual practice is just be, don't become anybody. We are constantly becoming. Shatra, Mitre, Putre, Bandhu, Makuru, Yatnam, Vigra, Sandhu. Kisi ko aao mat kao, kisi ko jao mat kao. Therefore, yam jnyatva, we have to just know our own being. And this knowledge is such, where no one is not born. The knowledge gained through the mind has these two aspects. One is um, atma bhava and second is anatma bhava. One is the ins and second is the not ins. So this is the Bluetooth and I am not the Bluetooth. So in the same manner, when we know ourselves, will it happen, uh, this is the Brahman, but I am not Rebaba Brahman, Apuna is it? No. You cannot know without being and you cannot be without knowing. Knowledge does not create anything. Knowledge only reveals. When eyes are open, all of you are not created by my eyes. Whatever you are, they are only shown. Pramanam Nyapakam Natu Karakam Pramana is the means of knowledge. Is only reveals what it is. Doesn't create anything. See? Therefore, yam jnyatva muchyate jantuhu amrutatvam cha gachati and he thereafter attains immortality. See? <coughs> now, what is again immortality? Immortality is you are not disturbed because of anything. You are <coughs> always happy. Now you will be more happy. Why? Cup of tea. <laughs> Om Purnamadaha Purnamidam Purna Purnamudachate Purnasya Purnamadaya Purnameva Vashishate Om Shanti 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 Hari Om Sri Guru Bhyo Namaha Hari Om <laughs>